pray. Pray from a place of understanding. Always bear it in mind that whenever you come to pray, you aren't coming to God to beg. You aren't a beggar. You come to Lambano. Lambano is a Greek word meaning to obtain, claim or take over. So you come before God to Lambano because he has made you a son and the co-owner of everything that belongs to him through the death, burial and resurrection of Jesus. It's your right guys, your inheritance. As believers, we should pray from a place of victory because we already defeated the world. 1 John 5 verse 4 the victory, the healing and all what's not has been given to you. When you come praying for healing, know that you have already been healed because by his stripes you have been healed. Isaiah 53 verse 5. All you need to do is to keep enforcing and keep claiming that which has already been given to you. Keep insisting on it through faith. Even when it seems like nothing is happening, keep declaring, keep decreeing. Know it today that the devil has been defeated and you need not go into battle with him anymore. All you need is knowledge of your victory in Christ and everything follows suit. When you know your identity in Christ, you realize that he has given you everything and I mean everything pertaining to life freely such that you need not beg for it, cry for it, nor even go about looking for one man or woman of God to pray for you or looking for signs and miracles. Through the finished work of Jesus on the cross, he brought you salvation and this salvation is a ticket to good health, prosperity, godliness, righteousness and so on. As a believer in the finished work of Christ, miracles, signs and wonders follow you. It is about time you avail yourself to that gospel of grace so that you can be transformed from the inside out. You have fed on gibberish enough. Devil has been cashing out on your ignorance. My people perish because of ignorance, says the Bible. This is a time to come in fully and access your inheritance. Stop living like a slave in your own palace. You are supposed to be a lion roaring at the charge of your kingdom and not a monkey hopping trees. It's time to stop being lily liver, catty footed and chicken hearted. You are light and once light comes in, darkness disappears. Listen dearest, make Ephesians 1 17, 22 your prayer and ask the Holy Spirit to help you. But then, after all said and done, the most important thing is believe. Do you believe? Do you? Hey, I hope you enjoyed all the episodes on Believe. If you missed any of the episodes, kindly check my previous posts to catch up. My name is Rosanna Ogechipu and of the Dauntless Dolches. It's my desire to see you transform into a better version of yourself and also not to give up on that dream of yours. Be dauntless and stay cursed. I, I love you. Bye.